I love those Monster Squad posters. I have to get them for $45. That's a life-size Frosty. It's $495, but... <sighs> Last night, Wolf Mother opened up uh, on JoeBlow.com and I got zero, almost no sleep at all last night because I was just tracking things, seeing everything was working properly. Um, so there was very little sleep last night. Uh, today's a busy day because I am taking a flight to New York tomorrow and I got a pack. This is what I take on the plane. A suitcase. These two different pockets here, then you have the, the, uh, the main the main area, two different pockets. Look at that, isn't that funny? Wall adapter for my MacBook Pro. So first thing is first, okay? I have this little bag as well, which goes into the backpack. Power supply, uh, pretty cool color. I got this about two years ago. It's probably about time I get a new one. The headphones, these are Beats Solo a Beats 2. I am very interested in selling these off and getting the new Bose Quiet Comfort. I can't remember the, the model number, but they're the wireless. These are wireless. Uh, they work fairly well. Let me check the battery on them. You check the battery by just clicking. All right, these are fully charged. Put these like this. You take the Beats um, case, and inside the Beats case, you have the, the micro USB to USB charger for the headphones if you need to charge the headphones. This takes care of my audio, uh, especially when you're in the airport, especially in the morning. You ever go to the airport in the morning and you're just like, it's just, it's you're so tired, you just wanna put the, the music on. I got a Bluetooth headphones, I'm good. I'm good. I'm unlocking the MacBook Pro with my Apple Watch. It's a really great feature. These are the in-case cases. I got one for the MacBook Pro, uh, 13 inch. And I got one for the, the iPad Pro, the Biggie iPad Pro. Look at that, look at the size of this thing. You still, every time I hold it, I can't believe it. All my devices are pretty much in gold if you come in gold. Um, I like gold, I don't know, it's my thing. If you don't think I'm obsessed right now, um, then uh, we're on the same team. Uh, but this is a pencil holder um, for, the, uh, for the Apple Pencil. So I got this little sleeve on Amazon. Um, if I can find the link, I'll put it in the description. But um, I ba look, at you basically do this, put it in there to make sure it doesn't get damaged. But you know the truth, this, this pencil cost $100. So you, cord, you want it to, you know, you want it to stay in good shape, right? The iPad Pro in there, and I just toss the pencil in there, in the case, it doesn't get scratched. Okay, so this is the thing. For the longest time, I wanted to know what Apple uses, okay? I want to know what Apple uses to clean their products in the store. I, I I am obsessed, I am OCD with cleaning my products, cleaning my iPad Pro, cleaning my MacBook Pro, cleaning my iPhone, cleaning my, my iMac screens. I mean, I, I'm just so obsessed with it. So I wanted to know what they used on their products, on the display models that are in the store because those, from my, from my experience, always seem to be clean. I mean, you know, hundreds, thousands of people touch these things and they're always seem to be clean. Most of the time, I would say 95% of the time. I, I mean, for years I've asked, what do you use? You know, I'd go, to, I'd go into the store, I'd ask an employee, what do you use to clean the product? And they'd say, oh, we, we sell it, it's right over there, it's right over there on the wall. This is what they, they introduced me to, um, and it's not a bad product. I would recommend it. I mean, I have a whole bottle here. I have a couple bottles, but this is not what they use. I don't know why. I think it's just because they want you to. They want to sell this product in in their stores, but it's not what they use. What they use, I found out with a little investigation. I was in Santa Monica at the Santa Monica Third uh, Third Street Promenade uh, Apple Store, and somebody was cleaning an iPad. An employee was cleaning an iPad, and I said. 
Ooh, what do they have there? What is in their hand? I would like to know. They had a bottle like this. Now I'm covering it up for a reason, but it had an orange top. There was like, there was no label on it at all. It was a blank label. Um, so it was just an orange top. They ran, the person that was cleaning ran out of the fluid inside and they went back uh, in, the, in the back room and came out, I was like five minutes later with the same bottle, but this time the label was still on. Whether they forgot to take it off, whether it's protocol to take it off and they just forgot, I, I, I don't know because I've never seen it. I've always seen the bottle with no label on, with the orange top, but the, the label was on this time. And guess what? I took a look at it, took a peek, looked this way, looked that way, looked straight ahead, and focused. And I saw this product. It's called Whoosh. It's called Whoosh. It's called Whoosh. This is what they use, at least from my experience, to use uh, on their own display models in the Apple Store. Now, this product is fantastic. It's a great product. That's a little tip for you. I don't know if you're as obsessed as I am to keep your stuff clean, but I'm very obsessed.